Um, let's go one, two, three. And then we'll go across on the ones that seem harder or what have you. So we have one crown on this guy for whatever reason. So, salam. My kids think I'm a grandmaster. Don't tell them otherwise. <laughs> oh, Amir. <laughs> Uh, what is that? Okay, we'll take the center. It's a Carol Khan defense. This is a good one that a lot of uh, pros are using right now in their tournaments. So we'll develop with the knight and we'll take the knight back. develops his bishop onto the f file and we do let's uh let's develop a light square and see if he wants to trade so he takes back preparing the castle here a lot of pressure coming in but E4 is currently safe. Looks like he's going to push C5 with that queen move. So here. Well, to get ready for that. Let's play H3. H3 stops the bishop from coming down. And also that knight is eyeing that square too. So, um... That's good for us. Let's get our bishop developed. Um, let's not let him do that. See, he had, here, here are the available squares for the knight. Right here, 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 here. So, the only place I'd really think he would be wanting to go is here. Which means then he'd be looking here. So maybe, maybe not here. Get away for the knight f4. I feel like that's where the game's gonna go down. So let's slide our knight back. And looks like he's getting ready to feign Kedowa's bishop. So we're gonna get ready to offer a trade for that because it's powerful. That's hanging, so... Well... Let's see, what do we think? What do we think? What do we think? We could immediately attack this bishop if we wanted. But he can feed in Keto. I would say push this pawn up, but there is a knight, so I still like this idea of knight f4, stops that, and that is a threat that can be avoided. Um, let's use this opportunity to attack. We'll go here. I'm seeing this bishop kind of eyeing down some stuff over here. He wants to trade. What's the best move? What's the best move? I don't understand this. No, wait, 
Huh? Is that a hanging bishop? Is that just a free bishop? Is that just a free bishop? Is why would why? Why would they do that? Oh, oh shit. So we take and he advances upon, okay. For nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Nothing. Oh, that's kind of cool looking. Let's pin that pawn. So that pawn is attacking our knight, and it looks bad. But the king is right here, and he can't castle because of this. <laughs> he can push this pawn all he wants. But it's not going to do him any good. Um, let's get ready to attack the pawn, I guess. See, the original idea of moving this here and this here was bishop g5, pinning that knight. But this also seems feasible now. They would go here. If you take here, well, I don't know. Because as long as you get traded out. He'd be able to castle, too. He'd be able to castle. Let's pin the knight. Let's pin the knight. We got lots of pins here. All right, this pawn is still pinned, but it is also protected by his bishop now. So, in that case, we can attack the bishop, g4, that's a possibility. Also, Knight h4 is a possibility. I don't like it as much. Thing is, he can castle next move. Our bishop is no longer here, threatening that square. So, kingside castling is 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 very, very possible for Amir. So. We'll be fine attacking. He crashes in. All right. All right. All right. All right. Why do I feel like that's a bad move, though? I feel like it's a bad move. Here's a kind of a thing here. Bishop takes, bishop takes. Bishop takes, queen takes. So it would be stronger to just take it back. We will take it back. And uh, here, okay, so this 
this is kind of a rule of queens so you have this pin here right and you have this pin here but this pin is on the king and this one's on the queen so it may seem at first like taking this is fine but it's actually not because if you take that there then even though this knight is pinned by the bishop the knight is going to take and he's and, and and he's threatening he's threatening a queen so knight takes the rook you take the queen and instead of recapturing bishop he takes your queen can't go here yeah. can we does it look like a possibility threatening this square right here there's a lot of stuff going on in that square for a knight to be in I like that option too I like it I like it we'll maintain our pins on the queen even though this is no longer a pin once I play this move right here. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Well, I'm interested as to why that move was played. You know, um, it doesn't really make any sense. We're just going to go with a fork here. Unless I'm missing something drastic, this is just winning for white. Yeah, there there it goes. And then yeah, you have to protect your knight. You've got to protect your knight. And now I'm going to threaten the queen. This square is still safe. Okay, two pieces. Hey, if you can get two pieces for a rook, do it. Uh That's a inaccuracy. That's my inaccuracy right there. But we're up plenty of material right now. And um, we're doing all right. We're doing all right. Um, we're doing all right. I still can't utilize this pin because of where my queen is. So we'll relocate the queen to somewhere if we went here this would be hanging so we'll go here that's not a move I expected you have successfully put your king on the same diagonal as my attacking queen so we'll open up that so he wants to take and that's fine with me because here comes check with a, an attack on the queen Moscow, Moscow. That bishop is ours now. Okay, um, 
if you're ever not a computer and you're in this position and I play knight b6 threatening your bishop try and protect your bishop it's gonna get traded anyways but don't just give it to people so I had a little more pride than that have a little more pride robot Um, I think we can do a little thing here because of our material advantage. Pin the knight, attack it twice. Ooh, that's a good move. That's a good move. I have to give it to him. I didn't think of that. But we're going to keep the pressure on here. We're going to keep it real. Keep it lots of real pressure. That was me being blunderous because we're up so much. Should we grab a queen? I think we should grab a queen. I feel like we should grab a queen. That's what I feel like. Yeah, what are you doing? Your kids never checked you before? Well, tell them to check. Check it. Check it. Let's go right here. It doesn't matter too much, honestly. Game's over. Game's over. Let's just get a queen. Let's get a queen. Alrighty. Now listen here, punk. Listen here, punk. Can't take it because it's a queen. And now we go here. Here. And checkmate. Wow, Amir, you played uh, like a bot. You played like a bot. I have to say, maybe you should teach my kids. You don't have children, Amir. You don't have any children. I'm sorry. You have no kids. Alright, we are going to play <laughs> Sven now.